All right, everybody, what is up? It's Flex, welcome back. In today's video, guys, we're just gonna be talking about a potentially a new game mode coming to Rainbow Six Siege. Um, I'm just gonna be talking to you guys about my opinion on it, and if they, Ubisoft should add a new game mode or if they shouldn't. So there were rumors around, I'm saying that there might have been um, a potentially a new game mode coming out to Rainbow Six Siege, and that's why basically, what do you call it? Operation Health took like six months, you know, to, for any sort of new content. And uh, basically, they were sort of heading towards like a zombie game mode. And as much as that would be cool and all, um, that would be pretty weird. But I don't think it would really suit the theme of the game. And um, like, I don't really see many people asking for it. Like, from everyone watching my streams back to the times where I was very popular getting like 2k views months ago um, on my streams and um, my streams currently at the minute I don't really see or hear any people or any people don't they never ask me saying about adding a new game mode or they never add, talk about a song the game mode they don't really talk about that I don't think it's really what the community wants to be fair um, at the minute um, like I don't really think it would sit the theme of it as well I think it's probably Next stage a wee bit more of like a weird game. I don't really think it. It just doesn't sit the theme. That just doesn't bring a good vibe. I don't think it's it, like it would be cool enough that that like a new game mode. But I don't think they should do like a like a zombie game mode. I think it'd probably be more like a maybe like the way Call of Duty did, where you would go and have certain waves and basically hordes of enemies were coming at you. Obviously, um, it would be like you know terrorist people you know who you're fighting against you know from different countries and stuff but this time like you have sort of like strikes even so you know the way modern warfare 3 survival did was you could call in air support and you could call in squad units for backup and like riot shoot people i thought that stuff was cool if they could do something roughly around that but with more um swap team base like you can call on different swat units to help you if, um you know sort of like just money like a point system, I think that would be pretty damn cool because like as much as not many everyone would like it but personally it would bring like a new coat into the game and it would sort of revive the game a wee bit, you know, some sort of like new content I guess but you know, the map and the operators we're getting at the minute, you know, they're cool and all I guess, <laughs> the map doesn't really look that good in my opinion um, it reminds me of like a Black Ops 3 map actually, which is annoying um, I don't know why they would make another skyscraper map, um, because they already have one, but, you know, that's another video for another day. Or, if they actually done what MW2 did, where you had spec op missions, and it was sort of like a co-op campaign sort of thing, where two people would go out, they would do, like, pure in-depth missions, like, take people out, there would be stealthy missions, there would be, like, missions with AC-130s, and you know there was all that sort of good stuff and you were hiding when you were in ghillie suits and stuff obviously no it wouldn't be exactly like that but if they could sort of add like a SWAT team base game more like that that'd be pretty cool going out in groups of four breaching places you know sort of like a different arena but not the map from multiplayer but just sort of like a new environment i think that'd be pretty cool let me know what you guys think comment down below thanks for watching i'll catch you guys in the next one